It's Liam Mouse Vlog, Liam Mouse Vlog, it's Liam Mouse's Vlog. Good morning. It's too early. We only got a few hours of sleep. But we have a maintenance guy here. He gave us a, an attic doorknob. Always a plus. And our tub was leaking down into the kitchen. So he had to tear apart our entire uh, tub thing here to remedy it and fix it. So we're up earlier than we'd like to be today and Derek has to work tonight. I don't. And by the way, I just colored my hair last night, as I'm sure you can see. Blah. We're just gonna hang out for now. Oh. So there's snow, not like in Buffalo right now. It's been snowing. We were looking at the news this morning. And so I saw posts on Facebook about all the snow that Buffalo got last night and they got like feet upon feet of snow overnight and I guess we moved just in time because holy crap I would not appreciate being stuck there in a snowstorm right now and we just moved like a little over two weeks ago so if we would have stayed even another month of our lease like if we would have had another month on our lease we'd be snowed in right now and we would really probably be able to move. <laughs> so I'm really glad we moved when we did because, oh my God. Yeah. It'd be nice to have a deadbolt on the front door because I don't trust doing knock locks. I know. I really and, and, and yeah. Like a, a screw, like a, Is he putting one on the porch porch or just the door? The door. I'm going to ask him. I don't know what he could, I don't know what he could do with. Because the porch I'm not worried about as long as we really don't. I'm not worried about the porch. We don't. I mean, it's not like we're gonna, gonna store our jewels on the no. porch. Yeah, I could put like just a heavy duty. They have make they make heavy duty slide locks like the size of my pinky. <laughs> duty. Exactly. But no time to laugh about it now. There's always time to laugh about duty. Yeah, hey, Lois. Mm -hmm. Diarrhea. Did you pee? Yes. Okay. So why well, have to pee extremely bad? I was waiting for you. To Way to ruin my diarrhea joke. I'm sorry. It is now two o'clock, and all is well. No. It's two o'clock, and <clears throat> we watch some Netflix. And since Derek has to work tonight, like we're both so tired, he went upstairs to take a nap, and the maintenance guy is still here. So I have to stay awake, which is really hard because I'm fighting to stay awake at the moment. Cause I'm so comfy here on the couch. All bundly. So Derek's upstairs taking a nap. I'm supposed to wake him up at 3.30 so he can have enough time to be awake before work. I set an alarm on my phone for 3.30 just in case I fall asleep. <laughs> so I fell asleep on the couch a little bit and I woke up to this ding 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 and well That is leaking oh. all down the hell there. He said the pipe might have broke or something. Yeah, that's pretty bad. It's leaking worse than it ever has before and it smells really bad. Yeah, it like leaked all over our fucking stove. Which Derek's not gonna be happy about, but I put down towels the best I could. So he went back up to check it out. So the kitties are very happy to be out of their upstairs prison. Aren't you Watson? Yes, okay. Good, all right. And Houdini is very happy as well. Aren't you Houdini? Yeah? <laughs> no, no biting of the camera. So apparently it's this big issue, the leak. And what is it? You understood what was going on. The pipe broke somewhere between the... Off the main drain pipe, the pipe is apparently leaking pretty bad somewhere right above the ceiling in the wall somewhere. Because there's the main drain pipe that comes off the tub and then it splits off. 
and goes to wherever our waste pipe goes to, our dirty water and that. And apparently it was leaking. So, so they, they got to tear down the whole kitchen sink. They have to come in tomorrow, tomorrow morning, and tear down the whole ceiling and get in the wall and like and angle it around in their, like, super magical plumbing ways to fix it. So we will have people, because it's a full-day job, and the guy who was here didn't know how to do it. So... I want thing! And they're bringing in a contractor. Yeah, they're bringing in a contractor. So... We have that to look forward to tomorrow, don't we? Don't we? Your hat is awesome. I love your hat. Thank you. <laughs> so this was their playroom for the night. Or their sleeping room. Oh, and Houdini is eating. We've got their favorite little blankie. Got their boxes they like to play in. Their laundry basket. Their restroom. And their feeding area. Which Houdini is utilizing to the maximum potential at this moment. There seems to be a plastic picture frame thing around this plug. That's very interesting. It's upside down. That means it's connected to the light switch. I know stuff. Hey, Watson. Hi. You want to play with Bali? It's like they're taking turns. <laughs> I was enjoying them watching them terrorize the ball in their bat their box upstairs. Oh, that's nice. It was sweet. Is it cold out? A little bit, yeah. What is it like degrees degrees wise? It's fucking cold. It's fucking it's, cold. <laughs> this says it's zero out. Really? Yeah. Oh my god, it does say zero. It says 16 degrees. Feels like zero. Yes, yeah, felt like negative eight earlier, and it's snowing. Yeah. So, I need some gloves. That's what my only problem. I'm warm besides my fucking hands. I have little blue, like, Pokemon mittens with um, yellow tassels. No, I ain't good. <laughs> so now, Derek went to work, and I am going to edit the second vlog. Not second vlog, the other vlog where I. We actually moved in here cats are going to play and cause trouble and eat the floor apparently. Hi! So I'm going to edit this and I will check back in with you guys later. Houdini says hi. Come on Watson, don't give up so easily. And now I have a little purring editing buddy. You have such a loud purr. No wonder Derek won't let you sleep in the bed. You keep him awake with that sweet little purr of yours, don't you? Yes, you do. Get comfy, honey. Watson's my baby. Houdini is his more so. So don't push any buttons. <laughs> right next to my laptop. Oh, you're drooling. You're just like Mocha was. Drooling all over my stuff. Hi. Aw, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the kisses. Watson, give me a kiss. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Aw. 
fucking cute. I got so many watch and kisses. Thank you, honey. You're such a sweetie. Yes, you are. Oh, she gave you guys kisses. I hear Houdini. Here she comes. Hi, Houdini. Thank you for leaving a little drool puddle on my laptop. That's great. Hi, Houdini. You can both come up here as long as you stay off of my computer. You have a problem with being on a computer. And now they're playing with the blinds. And Watson apparently is more just in the blinds. This is my life. Well, this isn't my life. I'm not usually here. This is like one of the only days I've off I've had in, in a long time. That is a fantastic place. I paused my video where I'm editing. Look at my face in that screenshot. That is, that's just, that's very flattering. I'm, I'm proud to be that person right now. I truly am. And now for my super amazing awesome dinner, I am cooking on our gas stove. Thank you very much. This lovely, wonderful, ki ew, Campbell's creamy chicken and dumplings chunky soup. It's actually extremely good. I love this type of soup. Crap all over my finger. I love having a gas stove because it's like you don't have to wait for the dumb shit to heat up and, you know, there's no burner incidents, accidents, you know, you don't grab a burner that you don't realize is hot. <laughs> And, you know, the flame just comes right on there and just cooks evenly, and it's very, very nice. I'm having trouble holding the camera and stirring this with a pot going flying, so uh, thus ends my soup-making portion of this video. Yeah, and I want to show you guys, since last time you saw, you know, we didn't really have any furniture or whatever, so we do have this gas stove that we got, and we also have a refrigerator. There it is. And this room here, the one that I said was going to be like my office-y type of room, I got set up pretty nicely. This is all my candle stuff. Well, half of it. The rest of it's still at my mom's, and I have to find time to go get it. I was going to go today, but the freaking snowstorm was like, no, you're going to stay here and edit a video instead. And I'm like, all right. So I got all my books here. And I got Jack Skellington chilling out there, and there's Marilyn and Lenore, my living dead dolls over on this side. I got my collection of wine and other alcohol bottles that I got while I was actually working at a housekeeper. I found these in the hotel rooms, so it's not like I'm an alcoholic or anything. I just like the bottles, so I kept them. Hi, Houdini. And this, this is fan mail. That, hi. That's fan mail, and this is my cross-stitching crate, some of my CDs. I mean, it's obviously not complete yet. There's still boxes over here that most of them are empty. Some of them still need unpacked. These are two little lanterns that Derek and I got last Swiss Festival. That's his, because it's blue, and that's mine, because it's purple. We got it from a vendor when we were there selling candles. So, oh, and there's this mirror. What's up? And the cats follow me everywhere I go, which I think is absolutely adorable. Oh, this is neat. I hung this up. My mom got this for me at a flea market, actually. I don't know what it is. It's like some kind of African art of some sort. And there were two of them. And I, for some reason, really, really liked it. So my mom got it for me. It was like 30 or 40 bucks or something. But there it is. So this is what this room is turning out to look like. Um, still a work in progress, obviously, but I'm going to be shooting my videos in here, my main videos, which I need to do one later tonight because, oh my god, I'm so behind. So I think I'm just going to do one of my birthday presents finally. I mean, it's way outdated, but I do want to show those things off because I did get some really cool stuff. People deserve to see that stuff on video because I promised. So I'm going to shoot that later after I eat my soup. You guys going to want to come with me while I eat my soup? I think Watson looks like a chicken when she sits like that. Watson, are you a chicken? You kind of peck at the floor like one sometimes. Aww. Hi. Houdini likes to say hi to you guys. Hi, baby. Soup time. Mm. Yum. Yes. So in preparation for the video that I'm going to shoot, the main channel video, I'm scared of having this hot curling iron right here because she keeps jumping up on the counter. 
I have curled my hair. I am not finished with it yet because, well, the tutorial for it is not finished yet. I just have to let the curls, the c -c -c curls, the curls cool. I'm not the greatest at curling my hair. My hair does not accept curls very well, but I think that it listened pretty well under the circumstances. So, it's the first time I've ever done this type of thing, so I'm sure I'll get better at it. And my hair will get used to it. So, I'm doing my makeup now while I wait for these to cool so I can finish watching the tutorial to figure out what the hell else to do with this mop of blah. <clears throat> and Watson is showing me how brave and fearless she is by chilling in the tub. And she's never done that before. I think she knows that the tap cannot be turned on because of the leak. So, she's not fearing like a kitty bath. And Houdini is safeguarding this cupboard for us. Yeah. Do you see yourself? Do you see your little kitty reflection in that? <laughs> so I'm doing my makeup and I hear this little scuffling sound next to me. Hi Watson. That is a teeny tiny little space. I have no idea how she even fit back there. Cause I'm like right here against the door. She would have had to crawl in right here and like walk in backwards. I have no idea how you did that. <laughs> You're so cute and weird. I think she would be the world champion hide-and-go-seek contender. Well, I'm obviously very new at this whole curling my hair thing because it doesn't look great, but it'll do. And I will get more practice the more I do it. And hopefully I'll be able to look how I want to look with the curliness, but I don't know. My hair doesn't cooperate either. That's the other thing. And it is so hot up here, and it is probably killing a lot of my curl. <laughs> She's still behind the door, and all I can see is her foot. Hi, Watson. Alright, well, I'll, guys, I'll leave you guys to it, and I'm going to go make my video. I'll leave the light on for you. They redid the heating ducts a little bit today, and it definitely is showing, because it gets very warm upstairs now, and that was Derek's biggest thing, was like, yeah, it doesn't get warm upstairs! Ah! And now it's extremely warm upstairs, and cold down here. So, <clears throat> alright, what the hell should I make this video about? Oh, okay. Mm-hmm.